It is one the world's most tantalizing mysteries, and over the years experts have flocked to the Scottish Highlands to answer its call. Now an international paranormal investigator turned monster hunter believes he may have found proof that the Loch Ness Monster exists. Jonathan Bright, a Greek known around the world by his English name, has captured what appears to be Nessie's head emerging from the deep waters. The image is remarkably similar to the underwater picture taken in 1972 by esteemed scientist, Dr. Robert Rines, who spent years searching for the elusive creature with sophisticated underwater cameras and sonar equipment. He died in 2009 never having obtained conclusive proof but his gargoyle head picture and one of what appears to be a long-necked beast swimming through the water remain the best images of what could be Nessie. Although Mr. Bright is not claiming to have a photo proving Nessie's existence, he plans to return to Loch Ness after examining thousands more images he has taken there this week. The 46-year-old said yesterday, I investigate the paranormal but I also investigate legends and Nessie is one of them. Among others I have looked at is the Dracula stories and I traveled extensively in Transylvania to investigate that. Three years ago, I came to Scotland to investigate the Nessie legend and took thousands of photographs. It took me six months to look at them all and I found this one which I showed when I spoke at the Scottish Paranormal Festival in Stirling this week. After I had finished there, I came north to spend more time searching for an answer to the Nessie story. My picture is a talking point. Some people will say it is physical and the monster, others will say it is a trick of the water, others will say it is a hoax. It is what it is, and I hope to find more proof now and in the future about what the Loch Ness Monster really is. I have contributed to many TV stations including the History Channel and I hope to have something interesting for viewers once I go through all my footage and if they decide to show my material.